How you doing? I'm Daryl Pear from the Swanson Golf Center. We're out shooting some video tips today and I thought I would take some time to show you a little bit of what we do in our club fitting here. Uh, we have TrackMan Launch Monitor that gives us a lot of good information, a lot of good data. I had one of our uh, instructors here earlier hit some drivers, uh, one with too little loft, one with close to the right amount of loft, and one with too much loft, just to kind of show you what happens when you get into those situations. The one with too little loft, he launched on an average of eight degrees with 1,500 spin rate. He was only able to carry that golf ball 165 yards. The one that was more appropriate at loft he was able to launch at a better number at 11.4 degrees spin rate at 3,000 he carried that ball 221 yards and then the last club had a little more than he probably needed so his launch angle at 15.2 his spin rate of 35,000 uh, only carried the ball 212 yards now we didn't fine-tune anything and spend a lot of time with him just to kind of show you how loft can affect the golf shot trackman also prints out kind of an average or a good look at what those shots look like. You can see the white line being very low because it's so low it strikes the ground very early. Our yellow line being kind of through the middle there in a good optimal range for carry for a player. And then our pink line here being on the higher side, you know, doesn't carry quite as good as that yellow line. So with just a little bit of work and a little bit of loft change, we're able to see about a 35 yard difference for the player, which is a pretty big increase. So hopefully you can come out soon, take advantage of some of our TrackMan software out here uh, at the Swanson Golf Center, help you out, maybe pick up a few yards with your driver. Thank you for that. I'm Daryl Parrott, and thank you for listening on how we use the TrackMan.